One of the first videos on this channel was about the best note-taking software on Linux. I reviewed the most popular apps in that video. I also checked many other note-taking apps which you suggested in the comments. There were some great options, but none of them was perfect. Until I tried Notion. I believe Notion is the best note-taking app. Actually, it is more than just note-taking app. With Notion, you can take simple notes, manage tasks, organize projects, have a training plan, calculate your budget, plan your vacation, and much more. There are templates for almost anything. You can also create your own templates by customizing an existing one or by creating it from scratch. Moreover, Notion is probably one of the best all-in-one tools to work in a team. You can share some of your notes and work on them together with others. It is a web app, so it works fine on Linux, Chrome OS, Windows, Mac. There is also a very nice mobile app, so your notes are always synced across devices. Notion is free for personal use and reasonably priced if you want the pro features or you need to work in a team. Just use the link in the description to sign up. When Notion approached me to review their app, I agreed because this app made a very nice first impression. But after exploring it more, I fall in love with it. I am switching to Notion as my note-taking and organizer app. Let me show you how I use it. Maybe you will also like it. I didn't have a proper system to organize my YouTube video production. I had a list of potential topics in a spreadsheet, scripts as separate documents, and schedule as a Google Calendar. I also used Trello for progress tracking. It worked, but I never liked it. Notion turned out to be a perfect app for organizing my YouTube video production. I can have everything in one place, and it is completely integrated. There is a simple table overview of all topics. If I click on any of them, I can open it and edit its script. The same information can be viewed as a progress board. So I can see potential video topics, videos which are in production, and videos that are done and published. I can also see how these video topics are distributed in my calendar. It is the same information which is presented in different views. This is extremely convenient. Writing video scripts is also very efficient. Notion has all the features of a powerful document editor. You can format your text by highlighting it and selecting the style. There are even more options which you can access by typing slash. For example, you can get a table of content with just one click. You can embed different media, add tables, calendars, and much more. I usually also add a progress tracker, which I can share with a sponsor if it is a sponsored video, so they can see my progress without emailing me. Finally, any video script can easily be transformed into a blog post. I just edit the script right here in Notion and export it as a markdown document, which is recognized by my Jekyll website. Another great option of Notion Notes is that it saves the history of a document changes, so you can revert to the previous version of the document if needed. There is also a word counter, which helps to estimate the length of a blog post. Code boxes. At my day work and in my YouTube scripts, I often have to use code boxes. Notion is very powerful in this regard. You can create a code box with syntax highlighting for any popular programming language. Here is an example with Python code. Tables. You can create tables inside your notes, and these tables, besides presenting the information in a convenient way, can also make some work for you. The simple budget template presents an example table where you can calculate a total sum of your spending. You can also use a formula for some more specific calculations. Another way to use table is presented in the template Habit Tracker, where you mostly use checkboxes. You can also embed a map in your notes. The Travel Planner template is a perfect example of this. And you can resize it as you want. You can also organize your notes into columns. A few note-taken apps can do that. I also have to mention that Notion has a simple and yet efficient layout. You can have an overview of your notes on the left panel. There is a multi-level organization. 
you can use icons for different categories. There is a number of built-in icons and you can also add your custom icons. For example, I added the YouTube icon for my YouTube notes. There is also an option to select between white and dark themes. When you create a new page, you are offered a list of shortcuts to format this new page as you need, in just a few clicks. I have shown some templates already. This is indeed a great advantage of Notion in comparison to other apps. I would also like to mention that there is even more templates which you can add to your Notion workspace. I believe Notion will increase your productivity and save you a lot of time. If I have not convinced you yet, you can try it yourself for free. Just use the link in the description to sign up. Thank you for watching.